And look now, I'm finding more fucking pills. More electrical tape is good. Small rocks. Ha! Get out of here. Can't carry any more. So those big nasty monsters are over, like, in the direction of the purple and yellow flag, in between the two, in that direction. What if... What if I... Come around this way... Fucker. Try my best to sneak around them. So I think at some point I'm going to have to get used to fighting those kinds of creatures. Just not entirely positive of what they are at the moment. The one looked like the thing in the picture that I found on the yacht. The other one, I have no fucking idea what it was. Okay, you listen up. I would suggest you leave. Right now. I'm not in the fucking mood for you. I'm not in the mood for you. You come over here, you're gonna get fucking jacked up. You understand? I'm gonna use this fucking axe to smack those fucking things right off your stupid face. Yeah, you better fucking hide. Do we have an issue? Cause I, I see you're all alone, and I know I can take you. Back up. Yeah, do your fucking growling shit. Don't give a fuck. There's a cave right here. Alright, let's go take a look. Especially since I don't want that fucking... That asshole coming back. Holy shit, how deep is it?
Was I here? Because there's a yellow house thing over there. What's that? It's another piece of the robot. I think I remember seeing that somewhere. Okay. Well, we got on a plane, that's for damn sure. It's like nowhere to go but up. I hear something. Like that that's a big open area we'll just sneak around this way okay okay one of those fucking big things is down here and I sure as shit hope that I'm not heading to heading towards it. God. Oh god. I'm gonna turn this corner and that fucking thing's gonna be staring me right in the face. Oh shit. Yeah. Maybe if I turn my light out, I can get like a little bit of a peek at it to see what it entirely was. Holy shit! Look at all that cash. And more fucking cloth. Flares and pills. The food here. There's more pills that I can't fucking carry. A soda, which I'll drink right now. More pills. More food whole bunch of watches I can't carry. Alcohol. Okay. Katana? Oh, wow. What's the damage on that? It should be high, right? It's medium. My axe does more damage than the katana does, but I can swing this a hell of a lot faster and cannot block with it. Or shouldn't block with it, but more gas that I can't carry.
Yeah. Okay. See, I don't want to leave a lot of this stuff here. Like circuit boards and stuff. What's back here? Those are sodas. Plastic flash. Oh, I got another flashlight. What the fuck is behind here? Oh god. It's a shrunken head collection. Yeah, not really interested. Not interested in the least. Okay, so that would dictate that if I went the other way from the ladder, the rope I climbed up, I would be facing whatever's moving around up there. And I'm so glad I didn't do that. trying to think what are circuit boards used for explosives duct tape watches alcohol coins and I guess a circuit board with watch coins Tape and alcohol. Then what? A head bomb or a sticky explosive? Okay. So why don't we make another one then? Wristwatch. Coins, alcohol, duct tape. How many explosives can we carry? I don't know. We'll just make them until we can't anymore. Wristwatch, tape, alcohol. Coins. Uh, wristwatch. Alcohol and chip. Okay, that should allow me to pick up more of this stuff. What else you got? More cloth. And that computer chip. And that computer chip. And that cloth. Don't want to leave the gas here though. That sucks. Why do I got to leave the gas cans behind? Alright, let's get the fuck out of here. Let's get out of here before anything bad happens. Just gonna have to move quietly, slowly. I don't think those monsters can climb down ropes. So 
So I think if I get to the rope as quickly as possible before they come out, I can escape and not have to worry about a fucking thing. I just gotta remember which way the rope was. Like, follow the boards? Uh, I don't like that fucking sound. I don't like the sound. I don't like the sound. I think that's the rope up there. Just get the fuck out of here. Yep. Yep. Sneaky. Super sneaky, but... I don't know. Oh, it looks like it's nighttime outside. Oh shit. Looks like I'm gonna be stuck here until morning. I don't think I have 26 leaves. Yeah, so this is going to suck. I guess, uh... Fuck. Provided it's not raining outside, we can probably mad dash it all the way back to the house. Hopefully we don't get spotted on the way. Fuck, this is the longest rope in the world. Yeah, it's definitely night. Oh boy. Alright. Let's make this as fast as possible. Can I make it across the water? If I can make it across the water, I can make it all the way to the ridge of the hill. And then it's just a matter of getting up the hill. Okay, and all those fucking assholes are up there. What, I'm not cold? Oh. Interesting how that works out. Hopefully this katana packs more of a punch than I think it does.
Where are they coming from? Lizard? Serious? Fuck off. The animals are trying to rat me out. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Way over there. There's a flaming human torch. Inhuman torch. Oh yeah, I filled that up at the pond. That's not good. Okay. Oh, the sun's coming up too. Get the red paint again. Don't exactly know what this shit does yet. But I'm almost home. I'm almost home. See, it looks like quite a bit of the trees have grown back already. Good. Let all the fucking trees grow back. Okay, not all the trees have grown back, but... Enough that I can feel safe, I guess, is the word. Yeah, I can swing this like a bitch, too. I just completely pimp slap whoever the fuck tries to mess with me. As long as it's not one of those big things. Fast forward a little bit. All right, sweet. Eat my fish. Spoiled. Ah. Uh. The wind's picking up. Drop that shit. Might as well drink the rest of this sh dirty ass water. Yep, that's what happens. There's the water. hell was that thing there? That thing was burnt to shit though. I hate the fact that at some points this this game chugs in frame rate. away the water. Now can I put the water from this into my water skin? That is the question I want to know. I want to know that right now. No. You cannot. So that means you gotta have a fucking water collector, huh? Okay. 
You win. Make a fucking water collector. I thought I didn't have to. But I guess you do in order to fill the water skin with pure water. Instead of just boiling water, putting... Boiling water in a pot and then pouring it into your fucking water skin like a normal human being would. I don't know. You just gotta be a dick sometimes. This game is always being a dick. I, I think that's enough for me right now. But that's not so bad. We found another... Another little cave. Got some good stuff. Got a katana. Which I'm really looking forward to breaking in. And um... Discovered some... Some new horrors. That plague the outside. Plague the land now. And we still haven't even begun looking for Timmy. Well I guess I have begun looking for Timmy. But I've only searched two caves out of maybe like a thousand. That are potentially on the island. I don't know where to go next. So, don't really know what else I could really do. One thing's for sure, I don't really want to fuck it. Yay, I got two more logs. I think everything else is pretty much shit. Um... I really want some of these trees to, to grow back. Maybe if they do, uh, if I can survive long enough. Wait a minute. Okay. No, don't equip it. Damage? Oh, fuck. I still prefer this, though. Um, hmm. I'm not wearing the red paint anymore. Still don't know what that shit does. But I think it respawns every time I exit the game. So if it does, I can put it on and risk. And like kind of test around, see what the... You know, just see what red paint does. Uh, more? Oh, it's a squirrel running around at the bottom of the fucking pond. What the hell? Oh, it's already dead. Let's get this one. And this one. This one can't carry any more fucking fish, huh? Yeah, I was gonna say you can carry, you can hold more than that. Fucking squirrel! Oh, that was overkill. You guys are fucking weird. Weird ass squirrels. Um. Oh yes, rabbit fur. That's what I was working on. Two to make a pouch. Okay. Um. What else did I want to craft? The small rock bag. Small rock bag. Now I can hold what 25 rocks? I think it the wiki said. 
spear bag. I don't care. I don't care about the spear bag. Okay, but I need small rocks. I need leaves too. I'm dangerously low on leaves. So I'm not sure, but I think because of the deforestation on the top of that hill over there, I definitely have to think that I've instantly made that a hot spot for cannibals now. I don't know for sure, but I've never seen them come up here, and during the like earlier in the video you could see that there was at least 10 of them like a, a nice thick pack of them running around up there and it is night time again Gonna be awesome. Where the fuck are all the small rocks? Small rocks are no more. There's no more small rocks for me. Okay, luck it. Thank you. set up traps soon. Let's take a look at some traps. Traps and defenses. Rabbit? Don't care. Molotov? It's, mm, wouldn't be good. Deadfall trap. Happy birthday trap. Noose trap. Rope swing trap. Defensive spikes, defensive wall spikes, defensive walls, and a catapult. That's all we got to work with. These are the only ones who... This is the only trap that doesn't require rope at all. I might have to go with that. I might have to go with that. I might, like... Stick it within the tree line because you know, just in case they they come through here, like through the tree line, there's like a pretty good chance that they'll set off the traps and get instantly killed. On the downside, if they see the traps, they might get suspicious and venture further from the traps, which will lead them right to my fucking cabin. I don't know what to do. Might have to channel my inner Macaulay Culkin. I don't know. But it's not like I don't have a way off the mountain. It's a pretty good way to just sneak off the mountain. I just wish these guys were still using flashlights. Am 
my stats okay? It's one thing I really haven't been looking up on. Stats. I am sick. Apparently. But I'm feeling good. But I'm sick. Find aloe. I think I have aloe. Okay. Yeah, I'm not sick anymore. Woo! Am I sick again? Okay, what the fuck was that? Did I get sick from eating the fish? Was the fish bad? What the fuck? Let's go take a look down at the at the uh, the pasture and see what's going on down here with these motherfuckers. Absolutely no movement. So there is a cannibal village right through those trees in front of me. And I kind of did venture off like towards that um, that purple flag there. But what is behind it? That is a good question. What is behind that? Fortunately, I don't... Yeah, you fucking bring it and we'll see what happens. Bring your fucking asses. I'm gonna lay down the law for you motherfuckers. You wanna step at me? I'll chop your ass up. Chop your ass right the fuck up. Cut your, cut you straight to the bone. Cut you motherfuckers straight to the bone if you come at me. Fish, the leaves on. Don't start with me, motherfuckers. I'll come out there. fish put that water on can we skip the night no not yet I just want to make it through the night if I can make it through the night then I can venture out try and find more of those caves I have a feeling that the caves are key to the story progression but I also got to find that sinkhole I don't remember where the sinkhole was but it's so massive I don't think I could really miss it one of these days I'm gonna look out there and I'm just going to see like seven cannibals and two of those big motherfuckers walking this way. And at that point, I am just going to lose my shit and jump off the side of this fucking mountain. Just jump off the side, run, and see if I can relocate somewhere else. <laughs> Making all of this for nothing. Making all of this absolutely fucking worthless.
I don't know why you have to wait until midnight to sleep. You should be able to sleep as soon as the sun goes down, but no, you gotta wait until midnight. But I guess sleeping is the best thing to do because that way you get that uh, you get that ten percent of tree regrowth. Like even if it's just one or two trees, still one or two more trees that I can reharvest and make some uh, traps. Because it, like the way I see it, if they were to come for me like right fucking now, there would be absolutely nothing I could do. Well, a shitload of Molotovs and a shitload of explosives. Got my good old katana, my flamethrower. These things hurt like hell too, so you never know. I, I might actually be able to do something about it, except if those uh, big things come by. I don't know how to deal with those yet. I've never actually even considered fighting one. So I don't fucking know. don't know oh come on come on actually I'm going to make this a left hot button and this will be the down hot button which it already is so now I can go ha and then go ha yeah Katana. Like, it's already got blood on it. Like, I don't even wash my fucking sword. You gotta take care of your items. You also gotta take care of the motherfuckers that keep screaming at night. They're just screaming in the midnight. They're just trying to creep me out so that I I give up my location and just give in to what they want. Not happening. Not fucking happening. Okay. That fish should be dried out by morning. I can take a few pieces with me. Okay, that's fine. Fuck me. Come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Stop being a stingy bitch and just fucking turn over. Ah, oh, that's fucking annoying. <laughs> 